Bless you. This is Crystal Bryant from Straightway, Florida. Shalom. You are loud and clear. Thanks for taking some time out and listening and calling in. Sister Crystal, what you got? Share something. Thank y'all. First of all, bless you, Sister Ashley, and bless you, Mother Jennifer. Um, I pray that everything comes across very clear because I am a little nervous, um, (laughs) but um, just to be talking on this platform, but I'm not going to let that get in my way. I wanted to share a testimony um, first off about what happened at the Dry Bones Conference in Jacksonville and then the Dry Bones Conference in Dallas, Texas. And, um, you know, I want to start off by saying I I heard a lot of people's testimonies and um, talks about how how people should come expecting something, and that's something that I didn't know. I was just really excited to see the man of Yah in person, you know, talking to us and, and teaching us and showing us, you know, righteousness and being to, uh, being able, I'm sorry, <laughs> being able to um, sit at the feet of, of wise um, seasoned women, um, mothers, um, sisters who have endured together. So um, I was just really excited. And um, when I went I I had um pastor started praying for um people with pain and disease and this is in Jacksonville and I started praying with them and I just begged and cried out to the father um to heal me. I had back pain for ten years, ten and a half years, um debilitating back pain. Uh, 99% of the time, my back was hurting, my lower back. Um, I actually was due to have surgery last this past February um, and didn't end up having it. And um, I also had these knots in the joints of my hands um, for the past year or so. And I couldn't move my hands when I first woke up. They'd be numb. My fingers, my um, my joints would just hurt um, really bad. And I cried out to the Father, and I prayed, and I could literally feel the pain leaving my body. It was such an incredible feeling. Um, it was an overwhelming joy, and um, I'm just so incredibly thankful for that. And then, um, well, prior to the conference, probably for the past four or five months um, prior, I had learned about the Holy Spirit, receiving the Holy Spirit in um, with evidence of speaking in tongues, and that's something that was foreign to me. Um, so I had been studying it and seeking the Holy Spirit diligently, And uh, my dear sister, Christy, she knew that. And at the conference, literally right after my healing, she turned um, and came to me and she said, don't miss your day of visitation. (laughs) Sorry, spirit. And I I was so scared, even though I knew that this was something that y'all had for me. And she walked me to Mama Carol. And um, I received the Holy Spirit, and ever since that day, my life has changed dramatically for the for the good, of course. And it's just been such an amazing journey. I'm I'm a newbie. I'm a baby, but just since then, it's been absolutely amazing. And um, coming to Dallas, going to the Dallas conference. Again, I don't know why. I, di- I didn't expect anything. I was just so thankful to be around the saints. And uh, a couple of days leading up to the Dallas conference, I had a growth um, underneath my tongue. It was about the size of a dime. It hurt so bad. I, I showed my master. I told him, you know, I, I don't know what it's from. You know, we prayed about it. Um, it hurt to eat. It hurt to talk, to move my tongue, period. It was just painful. And um, during the conference, everything that Pastor was saying, it was like he was a direct line from Yah. Everything that he touched on was things that I was dealing with, and Yah was working through him to talk to me personally. 
Um, and I'm very thankful that everybody else got healed as well. But during the healing, um, the growth that was underneath my tongue completely went away. And I just, I just wanted to come on here and just give that testimony and just praise Yahuwah and thank him for everything that he's done and possibly be a hope or an encouragement to any of my sisters um, that are out there as well. So um, that's all. And I also want to say thank you to all of the Georgia sisters who encouraged me to come on tonight and talk about my testimony. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Hallelujah. 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 Who shall not fear you, O Yah, and glorify your name? For you only are holy. For all nations shall come and worship before you. For your deeds are made manifest. Hallelujah. And you, my sister, were bought with a price. Therefore, glorify God in your body and spirit, which is Hallelujah. Thank you for your testimony. Uh, it definitely proves our shepherd's obedience, the um, you know, seal of the ministry, us, our, our fruit that follows, signs that follow. Um, thank you. Thank you, thank you to anyone who's listened that, it, that made an impact with you. You truly may never know um, why you called or needed to or share. Bless you. Bless you all of Florida. Thank you, Sister Crystal. Bless y'all. Thank you so much. Hallelujah.